Okay, so a customer just paid me in jewelry, which never happens. I mean, I got a necklace, okay, and I got a ring, and here's the deal. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This thing says 18 carats inside of it, okay? And then this necklace blew my mind, and I'll tell you why. It's because it says its purchase value is $1,800, okay? And I was like, dude, you're gonna get, I, I did an alternator replacement, okay? I was like, you're gonna give me all this for an alternator replacement? Eh, thanks. Awesome, I'll take it. But here's the deal. We're at a pawn shop to see if it's actually real or not, so let's go see. Hey, so I just had a, I had a simple question for you. I'm a mobile mechanic and I got paid with in jewelry. And a risky business, that's true, that is true. So here's the deal, I wanted to see if you can tell me, but you'll see why I, I was like, yeah, I'll take it. Cause it, this has a tag on it, right? And yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I don't even want to be the person. I can just tell by the way it's sticking to my magnet. That it's not real? It's not a $1,200 tag, no. Okay. I I'm not too, like, worried about it. It was only an alternator replacement. But it's, but again, I was like, man, he sold me on him. So I was like, dude, you, I, you've got some skill in the salesman business. It's not even, yeah, this one doesn't even pass my first test acid. I wouldn't even, I'd go put sugar in that tank. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man, I appreciate it a lot. Take, care, Take it easy, buddy. Don't do that again. <laughs> I won't, man. <laughs> Well, I got swindled. No, I'm just joking. It wasn't really that bad. I mean, I am going to tell them, you know, hey, obviously these things are fake. So that way I don't look like I'm being fooled. But at the same time, don't do that. <laughs> Clearly, I'm not a jeweler, but you can see why I would think, you know, it was worth some money. It's okay. I'm a little beat up about it. It's okay. They definitely got good guys. This says literally 14K on it. It literally says, I don't know if you can see that, but it literally says 14K on it. And I don't even know, this one says 18K in it. Obviously, here's the deal. I messaged the customer and I was like, hey man, I just I just wanna let you know, you know, you didn't get one over on me. No, I didn't, I didn't say that. <laughs> but I was like, hey man, these aren't real. But I was like, I'm not gonna cause nothing over it. I was like, I just wanted to let you know um, that I had these checked out almost immediately and that they weren't real. And then he actually cashed at me. So I was like, okay, that works out. And then he was like, I just, I was telling you basically the story that I got told about them. And I was like, you know, that's nice. I'll bring them back to you if you want. And then he was like, no, absolutely not. You can keep them. I mean, here's the deal, guys. Both of them together combined. I found the ring on Amazon. Okay, you can buy the ring on Amazon for like 100 bucks. And then the necklace, actually, you can buy at sales. It was like 344 at sales. So, I mean, I guess, you know what I mean? They're worth a little bit of something. But, so I did let him know that. But he was like, yeah, you can just keep them as a gift. And I was like, you know what? I will. I'll actually, I'll keep them as a gift. Thank you. Because I'm like some people, I like tips. You know, I like getting tips from people. And that, I guess, I mean, jewelry, whatever. But it's like, I guess, considered a tip. You know what I mean? Some people think, like, hey, here's a tip. Oh my God, no, what? Here's the deal. I'll barter work, okay? I'll barter work with people. How do you think I got this entire sleeve? Okay, I did a lot of work for a gentleman that does tattoos. So, there's things, there's hit and miss situations. I'm not a jewelry guy. I was, I grew up poor, okay, guys? I didn't have money for jewelry ever. So, I never, like, you know, that was never, I just never was taught about, I never learned about jewelry. Not that I was taught, I just never learned. I never took the initiative to learn. I'll learn something now. I learned something today, I'll tell you that. But at least, you know, he did pay me for work and then it's not like I'm out of, of birth. Cause then I would have felt extremely upset. I mean, I would have let it go, but I would have just been like, Psst, why'd you do that, man? You know what I mean? Cause that's silly. Who freaking trade, who, who's like, oh, that's cool. And I, and I, I mean, I'm a gold guy, I like gold, but I mean, who initially, who, who does that? Who's like, all right, alternator's all done. All right, here's a necklace and a ring. Uh, honestly, it threw me off guard, okay? It definitely did throw me off guard. But I was like, oh, it is pretty nice. Sparkly, I guess. It's too good. But I seen the tag, and then I seen the carrot deal. I didn't know that there could be a such thing as like 18 carat gold plated. I thought it was like, it was either gold plated or it was like, it was gold. I didn't know that like, what does that even mean? They put 18 carats of gold plating on it? Hey, but no shame, no foul, okay? I just wanna do that again, all right? No more, no more jewelry, guys. Here's the deal. If I do work, you know, it's either money or it's like, you know, 